mice in the basement. <laughs> anyway, let me tell you, my wife and me, we have sex almost every day of the week. Almost on Monday, almost on Tuesday. <laughs> Why, the other night, the wife said, Tony, let's try something different. So she tied me to the bed, then she went out. <laughs> let me tell you, after 30 years of marriage, sex life, I got no sex life. I wake up in the morning, vultures are circling my crotch. <laughs> Why, the other morning, this peeping Tom reached in through our bedroom window, he pulled down the shade. So anyway, the wife suggested I try Viagra, but it got stuck in my throat and I got a stiff neck. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Viagra, what I need is a blindfold. My wife calls it her beauty sleep. She said, Tony, I need my beauty sleep. I look at her, I say, beauty sleep, nothing. Try hibernation. Let me tell you. I once sent my wife's picture to Ripley's Believe or Not. Ripley sent it back. He didn't believe it. One time, my wife was giving a drowning man mouth to mouth. He pushed her away and drowned. Let me tell you something. My wife, her teeth are so yellow, she smiles and traffic slows down. But the good news is she got a part-time job at the prison curing sex offenders. Let me tell you this. Let me tell you. You can laugh if you want. They're pretty when you marry them. My wife, the only time she ever heard a whistle was right before the train hit her. <laughs> One time, I come home, my best friend is in bed with my wife. I go, Lenny, I got to, but you? So anyway, based on all that, yeah. based on all the above, I go to see my urologist. I go to see my urologist. I say, Doc, I have not had an erection in 10 years. Can you help me? He says, sure, just let me freshen up first. <laughs> all right, I got a new proctologist. Nice guy, pain in the ass. He uses two fingers. He uses two fingers so he can get a second opinion. So I got my, I got my pants down. I bent over. I got my cheeks all spread open for him. He brought the champagne this time. He says, Tony, it looks like you got hemorrhoids here. I said, Doc, what should I do for him? He suggested dinner and a movie. I tell you, let me tell you. I never had much luck with girls. I remember little Mary Lou Horton down the street. She said, Tony, come on over. There's no one home. I go over. There was no, no one home. I almost laughed at my own stupid joke. Jesus.